Hello friends, welcome back. Today we're going to add items using Splice. Uh, remember in the last challenge we mentioned that Splice can take up to three parameters? Well, you can use the third parameter compromised for, uh, comprised of one or more elements to add to the array. This can be incredibly useful for quickly switching out of an element or a set of elements for another. So numbers, here's we've got 10, 11, 12, 12, 15. Uh, we st our start index is set to three, and our mount to delete is one. So we're doing we're calling on the numbers. We're calling splice, and we're setting the beginning index is at three, zero, one, two, three, and we're only removing one. So removing the twelve, the amount to it, and then well instead of having the twelve in there, we're going to add thirteen and fourteen. Second entry of twelve is removed, and we add thirteen and fourteen at the same index. So the console is now 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. So we removed the 12 and we added 13 and 14. And that's how splice works. Here we begin with an array of numbers. Uh, we then pass the following to splice, the index at which to begin deleting elements, three, the number of elements to be deleted, one, and the elements to be deleted, 13 and 14, to be inserted at the same index. Note that there can be any number of elements separated by commons following amount to delete, each of which gets inserted. We have defined a function, HTML color names, which takes an array of HTML colors as an argument. Modify the function using splice to remove the first two elements of the array and add dark salmon and blanched almond in their respective places. So we want to remove the first two elements of the array. So we can go array.splice the first two elements. So zero because the first element is uh, is um, where we want to start off. That's the first element. And we want to er erase two of them. Okay, so now dark, golden, rod, white smoke, lavender blush, pale turquoise, fire brick has been altered. Now we just have lavender brush, pale turquoise, and fire brick. Is that what we want? Yes, because we've removed these first two. And then what we want to add in here is the string of dark almond and blanched almond here and so now we've got dark salmon blanched almond remove the first two elements of the array and add dark salmon blanched almond yeah dark salmon blanched almond and then the rest are the ones that we have left over so we've swept this function is essentially just swiping out these two uh, strings for these two strings. You should not use shift or unshift. Cool. We're not doing that. We're using splice. You should not use bracket notation. Okay. We could do we could do this with both of these. It would work exactly the same. Um, but this looks a little bit cleaner, and it's one. It's kind of a single line. Um, yeah, that's it. Run the test. Say pass. Awesome. Thank you guys for watching, and we'll see you in the next lesson.